Nearly the entire Battle Pass for Fortnite Chapter 5 Season 2, the season based on Greek mythology, has been teased by Epic Games in the files. So we now know all of the Battle Pass skins, and even a few skins that will be going in the item shop. And that's exactly what we're going to be going over in today's video. So stick around until the end, so you can know everything about next season's Battle Pass. Before I get into the video, I want to recommend you one thing. I post all the Fortnite leaks and news on my channel as soon as they release. So if you want to subscribe, you'll like missing out on some leaks and news. So if I was to take a second, quickly tap that red button. Now let's get into the video, I hope you enjoy it. So in the hot fix update that was released yesterday, we had a ton of teasers and assets to do with the next season put into the files. And these teasers and assets range all the way from the live event for the end of the season that leads into the next season, all the way to, of course, the next season's battle pass. And this NPC here named Odyssey was also added to the game at Risky Reels, but she won't be in our battle pass. And according to some leakers, it's expected that she'll be our ranked skin for the season, since she has a style for all the coloured ranks. And as you can see in this image here, the colour is on her right side, and the skin as a whole just looks so cool. And apparently it will be obtainable for free somehow. But now it's time to get onto the battle pass. I'm going to tell you the names for all of the skins. First up, we have Zeus, then Cerberus, then Hades, Aphrodite, Poseidon, Medusa, Artemis, and Ares. And on screen now, you can see the designs of these skins according to a recent player survey. But this survey did come out a few months ago, so a lot of the designs of the skins probably would have changed by now. But you can imagine they'll look something like this. But don't go yet, because I'm going to tell you how we know about this. It basically all stems from the new Pandora's box that was leaked for an upcoming live event tomorrow. And on the box, we can see four skins, which all have their own little sections representing them. The first one here is Zeus, who is the god of the sky. You can see he's represented by Mount Olympus, surrounded by all the clouds, and his skin holding lightning bolts. Next, we have Ares, who is the god of war, and he's represented by wearing a gladiator costume with a sword and shield. And next we have our personal favourite, which is Cerberus, who is the three-headed dog who guards the gates of hell. And he was already confirmed to us by the new mosaic which is in the game, which is to collect parts for around the map. And of course, Cerberus' head is right in the middle of it. And the last one is Hades, who by far looks the coolest there. He's the god of the dead and ruler of the underworld. And you can see his character is represented by a demonic-looking ghostly creature. And our last set of teasers also come from Pandora's box. On this orange orb at the front of it, over time it will show eight constellations that resemble eight of the Greek mythic gods we're going to be getting next season. The first one is this lightning bolt for Zeus. The second one is one of the dog heads for Cerberus. The next one is something for Hades. The next is a heart for Aphrodite. The next one is Poseidon's trident. Next is some snakes for Medusa. Then it's a bow and arrow for Artemis. And the last one is a gladiator helmet for Ares. So that's how we know all eight of the skins we're going to be getting in next season's battle pass. The four skins that are on the side of Pandora's box will 100% be in the battle pass since they're teased in two different ways. But the other four characters that we mentioned that were only seen on the golden orb are just possibilities. But I can imagine they will definitely be in the battle pass still anyway. But before the video ends, I want to remind Mind you that tomorrow at 12 p.m. ET, we'll be getting a live event with a Titan Hand and Pandora's box, where it'll finally be opening. I wonder if I found this live event is going to be so cool, and I'll be posting it straight after it drops. So I highly recommend that you subscribe to the notification bell so you don't miss it. I can't wait to see you all in that video tomorrow, and I hope you will enjoy. Have a great rest of your day. Goodbye.